Ladies and gentlemen, we are back with the action at Riot 547 live in Madison Square Garden. My name is Brian Williams, and right now we have an interesting matchup, folks. Right now we have the man, the deliverer of deliverance, the odd entity, and the god of war, Leo Grimm, going up against OCW legend, a man who has possibly done it all, and KD Angelo. You got Grimm, who is looking to make a name for himself here. Has some renowned feuds with Odin Klein, a fellow OCW rookie, and also another fellow OCW rookie in El Parca. Grimm started out here just to spread one message, and that message is of spreading deliverance. And he wants to make sure everyone in OCW gets their deliverance. This man. We have not seen in quite some time, has not had a match in a little bit here. And he, you can clearly tell, he bulked up. This man is clearly dieting on something, probably dragon's blood. But wow, is he a big, big boy. And honestly, him and Katie Angelo are really about to clash. And I'm, I'm afraid for the sake of the ring crew and the people that possibly, honestly, our insurance as well, because this ring could collapse on how big of these giants, what they could be doing in this match tonight is honestly insane. Grimm's on one mission tonight. And that mission is to give KD Angelo his deliverance as this intimidating man stands right in the middle of the ring, awaiting his opponent, OCW legend KD Angelo. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Grim, Angelo, let's get this fight on the road. Angelo bringing out some heavy strikes. Grim says absolutely not. Nice gut punch right there by the big man. Well, both big men. And just looking at the sheer size of both men, KD Angelo still is making Leo Grim look like a child. On how big. Grim has gotten, and wow, beautiful, wonderful modified spine buster there by Angelo. Absolutely dominating so far in this matchup right now. Going for a nice traditional rest hold. You know, big men, they need some nice breaks for their cardio, or else this match would be gone within five minutes. Angelo really pulling on the neck here as Grim's fighting to get his way out. Clearly, Grim is not well versed in the chain wrestling the nice standard waist wow beautiful clubbing strike there to the chest by kb angelo can't breathe if your ribs are cracked that's for sure some agility there by leo grim 
did not expect that from him whatsoever, that's for sure. Angelo with another modified spine buster there, just slamming Grimm straight on the mat. And with no, that padding isn't that protective. That padding does nothing for you. That is just your spine hitting a wonderful mat that doesn't feel good. But, you know, Grimm, clearly since the last time we have seen him, he has bulked up, drinking that dragon's blood, going on that pure dragon's blood diet, shoving KD down as he shoves his fingers in his throat. That's beautiful. I can only imagine where that glove has come from. KD says, get off me. You're not going to make a name for yourself right now. But Grimm still fighting, showing the old veteran that rookies can do what they want when they want. What is this here? Oh, dominating stomach punch there by Leo Grimm. And he's going to follow it up with a beautiful clothesline. Walking over the big man as he hits him yet again with another clothesline. And what is this? Is he going for the trifecta? I think yes, sir, he is. Slowing down the match, bringing KD to pace. Only a one count. KD is not down yet. Come on, Grim. You know you need to do better than that. You know this is KD Angelo, OCW legend. Grim grabbing him by the throat yet again. I think he's going back to gut punch. Oh, God. Yes, he is. Let's hope KD didn't have a heavy meal before he came to the ring tonight or else. Well, we just might be seeing it in this ring during the match. Positioning him on the ropes here, but Angelo says absolutely not. Throwing him over, but Grimm luckily grabs onto the ropes, doesn't plumb it down. But what's this by Angelo? Ooh, a beautiful suplex, definitely. Yet again, continuing that work on the back. Ooh, the vicious knee drop there by Katie Angelo, right onto the mask of Leo Grimm. Really surprised that that mask didn't have a crack just because of the python sized kneecaps that Katie Angelo has. This man might be older, but Jesus, he still is built like an absolute tank, and he is made to last. But Grimm getting some offense here. What is this? Picking up Angelo straight off the ground with a beautiful power slam. Grimm going for the pin here. Let's see if it'll last. Not even a two count. Yet again, KD Angelo is still proving age doesn't matter here in OCW. The only thing that matters is as long as you're here for a fight, well, KD's here to give one. KD going off the ropes here. And, oh, God, just slamming Grimm down on his back yet again. And now he's just going to get on top and do some good old ground and pound, just smashing his face in. Can't blame anybody for that. You want to try and touch me? I'm going to hit you back, fella. KD Angelo going for the pin now. Grimm, too. Oh, Angelo says, no, I'm not done yet. Ooh, and slams his head right off the mat there. Really kind of rubbing it in there, putting salt in the wound, but, you know, that's all right. Grim, no, he tried for it. He tried for that suplex, and Angelo said absolutely not by flipping him over. Beautiful hip hip strength by KD Angelo, taking Grim right into the corner now. What is this? What are we seeing here from Angelo? Wow! A football rushing tackle move right there. That was insane. Absolutely crazy. Oh, yeah. Angelo's absorbing that right now. Hearing the crowd roar for him as he just put, just shoved another grown man, another almost 300-pound man to the ground with another modified spine buster there by KD Angelo going to well yet again. That move is clearly doing the damage KD wants. But Grimm says, get off me. This is not what I want right now. This is not your time. I need to pick up the pace. Beautiful power slam there by Grimm. What's he going to follow up with? And a wonderful elbow drop there by Leo Grimm, picking up the pace on his end, trying to get his offense in. He is not down for the count yet and telling the old timer, no, sir, not right now. Ooh, just, a, just shoving him like he was shoving a little child. Jesus. Only a one count yet again. By KD Angelo, our official Ted clearly is just not counting quick enough for Leo Grimm's liking. Both men staring down at one another. In a, wow, tilt to world power slam by KD Angelo. Just wow, that was beautiful. Leo Grimm is still not out of this fight yet, folks. Going for those vicious forearm racks right across the eyes of KD Angelo, trying to blind him as he just staring into the soul there of KD Angelo as he is here for one mission and that is to give KD Angelo his deliverance 
Leo Grimm being tied up in a couple ways as he's been fighting Castianity with unlikely allies, Court Marshall and Justin Jess. Yet again, going for that suplex and Katie Angelo says absolutely not as Grimm needs to pick himself up from the ropes here. What's, what's Katie going for? Oh no, oh no way. Katie, what are you doing? Katie, what's this? Oh boy, Katie surveying the charge. Oh God. Picking back up in the power pop. Oh my God! Jesus, just slamming Grim on the side of the ring, and that is the hardest part of the ring. That did not feel great, but Grim just gets right back up and acts like he did not just get slammed by a grown man. Grim going for a power bomb of his own here. What is this? Wow! Just throwing KD Angelo like he was an absolute rag doll. Oh my God! Is he going to go for the count out here? Ted is at eight. He is at eight, but no. Grim. Grim opts out for the more honorable decision. Very, very curious here because he, he could have had him. Pretty sure Grim could have had him there with the count out, but he doesn't want deliverance that way. He wants to inflict pain and he wants punishment for the people that he is going to give the deliverance to. KD goes for a big kick there and misses it as, as Grimm follows up with a brutal clothesline to KD Angelo. Now KD needing to pick himself up onto the ropes here, but what's what's Grimm got going on here? Throwing KD over the top. What? Whoa, wait a minute. This is an OCW legend. Don't do this! Oh my god! A pile driver onto that protective mat, and that mat is not that protective. That is maybe two inches of, of rubber foam that does not do much. Wow, KD Angelo has to be concussed. This man has to be hurt right now, but he is still going and just, oh, another tilt the world power slam by KD Angelo. You can tell this man is angry. He is not. He is not okay with Grimm doing that to him. He knows that he is a legend in his own reign. He knows that some rookie cannot just lay his hands on him like that. Angelo going for the pin here. Only a one count there by our official Ted Grimm kicking out at one. Seemed like that match may have been over there, but not just yet. Both men eyeing each other down. What's this? KD wanting to run for something, but he didn't get it. Grimm trying to go for that pump handle suplex yet again. And KD just says no and once more flips him off of him. KD's calling for something here. What are you calling for, KD? Is this it? This might just be the end of it. Oh, the spear from KD. Wow. What an absolutely beautiful performance there by KD Angelo as he picks up the win against Leo Grimm. And we all know that is not going to make Leo happy. But what an excellent performance there by KD Angelo. I have been your special guest commentator, Brian Williams, and I will see you later, folks.